Giant Kodo moment. I think I know how to solve it, yeah. I think I can do this. Yeah, I think I got it, yeah. I don't have to look it up, hopefully. <laughs> I'm hoping not. Gotta be really careful, though. Just take the route I'm taking and you'll make it. Yeah, there we go. I did it. Awesome. Nice. Let's talk to Wallace from the side. I have a guy cut from, by the way, so let's talk to him. Uh, here's Wallace. Allow me to formally introduce myself. I am Wallace, the gym leader of Stopless. There's something about you, a difference in your demeanor. I think I can sense that in you. What happened inside the Cave of Origin and what you did, I will likely learn from our upcoming battle. Now show me, show me the power you wield with your Pokemon. And I, in return, shall present with you, uh, you with my, with a performance of Illusions in Water by me and my Pokemon. Interesting, I like his dialogue. So here's Wallace, the final gym leader of Hoenn. He's the master of all type of and the advice giver. Here's the way to Wallace, he, likes to, he wants to battle. He starts off with a solve disc that's level 40. Now this thing probably has cute charm or it has a tract. I'm pretty sure it has a tract. It might not have cute charm as its ability, but let's go for the leaf weight on this thing. It's level 40 female. Four levels higher than it, so we're in good shape, I guess, for right now, but we'll see about that later. Because some of his Pokemon are tough. So there goes the love disc, awesome. Nice. It's about to use Celio. Let's um stay in, I guess. Let's actually go for an epic subtitle sweep, that'd be cool. Let's go for another um, Leaf Blade on this thing. The Celio is level 40 in male. So yeah, it's Water Ice type, I believe. It's the pre it's the level from a Celio, but the pre level from a Walwin. Yeah, it's like the middle evolution of the uh, Celio family. So yeah. So there we go, one hit KO on both all the two opening Pokemon. Oh, okay, his, his big guns is coming out. He has five Pokemon, he has three left, including this one. This, uh, Myotech is really tough. Honestly. Let's go for the Leaf Blade and see how much it does. It's level 43 male, and it's one level higher than it, but still, it's like a powerhouse. Ooh, wait, only two, only two, um, Leaf Blades should take it out. That's awesome. Nice. What the heck? That did it. No! It froze Gecko. I'm gonna definitely use the full store now. Jeez. Jeez, I was, I was, I knew the ice beam had a chance to freeze, but like it caught me off guard, really. That actually froze Geico. Anyway, I can choose the full store. Can use the ice beam again, jeez. Hopefully, Geico is faster than the next turn. But we're in trouble, cause it'll, uh, it'll, uh, yeah, good. Cause, um, it, ice beam would have fainted Gecko then. So our epic Sceptile Sweep is still intact. We defeated his hardest Pokemon, so that's good. Nice. Okay, which cast is gonna be really easy because it's water ground type, so that means it's four times weak to four times weak to grass type moves. So that means so like for example, um Giga Drain will be four times super effective. So that's what I'm gonna use and restore some of Gecko's HP actually too. Cause uh water is weak to, against grass type moves and then water type Pokemon and then also uh ground type moves uh, ground type Pokemon are weak to ground type uh, grass type Pokemon. There we go. The wish cast goes down. So the only Pokemon in his party that's really giving me trouble so far is Milotic. But yeah, he's, he's, done last, he's done to his last Pokemon just as Seeking, so 4 2 in male. Uh, yeah, so let's go for the Leaf Blade on this thing. I'm not speeding all of his Pokemon, which is actually pretty nice. We're 2 levels higher than Seeking, or Skyco is 2 levels higher than Seeking. We went for an epic Sceptile Sweep, awesome, nice. Cool. Gecko, grade level 4 5, awesome. We defeated Wallace. That wasn't actually that hard of a battle, to be honest. Bravo. I realize now your ethnicity and magnificence as a Pokemon trainer. I find it much joy in having met you and your Pokemon. Thanks, Wallace. Vice versa, you too. Ditto. <laughs> you have proven yourself worthy of the Rain Badge. Except it. I was right, the Rain Badge. Nice. We got 4,300 4, Pokemon. We got 4,300 Pokedars. There we go. For winning. Awesome. Nice. We get the rain batch from Wallace, we receive the rain batch from Wallace, awesome! Yeah, cool. Having that badge assures you the full abundance. Ob or I don't even know how to pronounce that word. There's so many words in this game I can't pronounce still. It's kind of sad. Of all your Pokemon to every command you like. So yeah, obedience. Obedience, there we go. Uh, it's like obedience. <laughs> okay. The badge will allow you to use the HM move waterfall to scale walls and of cascading water. And so that you never forget the battle we shared. Take this. 
we get TMZ Earth, which is water pulse, I believe. Yeah. Which is actually a not it's like a mediocre water type move, it only has like 60 power. Like he should have given us like hydro pump or something, you know? But whatever. The that team I handed you contains water pulse. It in use it will occasionally conf confuse the target with its ultrasonic waves. Interesting. So to get out of this gym or to get to the very front, you just have to basically fall through that patch of broken ice, and then you have to slide down here. And after you beat the gym leader for any gym, all you can't battle any of the trainers, at least the ones you've didn't battle, so like you don't have to worry about having to battle any of the trainers because they'll be already defeated, I guess, after you beat the gym leader anyway, for sure. So let's talk to the vice giver. Yao, you beat an even Wallace, who is supposedly the best of all Hoenn. Uh, okay, check out your trainer card. If you've gotten all the badges, you're set for the Pokemon League Challenge. Awesome. So let's check the statue first. Let's, uh, read the statue. So you top West City Pokemon Gym. Wallace is certified trainer, Steven. Awesome. So yeah, if you got our, if you got our trainer card, we have all the badges now, which is pretty cool. So that's awesome. So yeah.